Beach. You may have seen them hordes of strange cellophane like sea creatures washing up along our Southern California beaches. As eyewitness news reporter Sophie Flay explains, they're related to the jellyfish, but they are relatively harmless to humans. You might have noticed these blue jelly like creatures washing up on shore in Huntington Beach and the South Bay. They're known more commonly as by the wind sailors because of their sail like tops, but their scientific name is Velala Velala. That sail allows the wind to carry them in, in hopes that they that they increase their odds of, of finding food. They feed on plankton and algae and their main predator is an ocean sunfish called Mola. If you're just hearing about these tiny organisms, they're actually not new. And there's no obvious reason as to why more of them are showing up on our beaches. According to Nate Jaros, curator of fishes and invertebrates at the Aquarium of the Pacific. Sometimes there's just this enormous amount and uh, everybody really gets to see it. Other times it'll be a little patchy and it can it happens from here up through, you know, the entire West Coast, really. Though they're not exactly jellyfish, they are related to them. By the wind sailors don't sting like jellyfish, but they do have tentacles on the bottom that can irritate the skin. They're mostly harmless to humans. They do have stinging cells on their tentacles that hang down when they're floating in the water. So if you see these on the beach, it's okay to hold them by their cell, but I would avoid touching the stinging cells. For most humans, it doesn't hurt, but I wouldn't touch those stinging cells. And why are they blue? The blue part is a natural pigmentation that they have that just protects their more sensitive parts from the UV rays of the sun. Hello, I'm Mark Brown. Get more great ABC7 content by clicking the subscribe button for our YouTube channel and download the ABC7 Los Angeles streaming app on Fire TV, Android TV, Apple TV, and Roku to watch on your TV.